I am here with Jules and Jesse Hogan at Metro Fest. I'm Alex Barth. Guys, thanks for joining me. So, twins, if you couldn't tell. And uh, Jules, you were a soccer player, I understand. And a track player. And a track yeah. player. Is it player, track, runner, track? I was wondering that. Track runner, okay. And Jesse, you're, you're an aspiring artist. Yes. All right, don't cut, don't cut your ear off. Don't, yes. don't aspire that much, okay? You need both of those. So, uh, Jules, I'm going to start with you. Um, you play at your, your, uh, your middle school, high school. I know 14 is like right um, on that well, line. I'm going into high school going now, into high but school. our okay. school actually um, is a middle school and high school. Okay. Together, so, we're not really moving up that much. Just All right. Not That's good. You don't have to deal yeah. with that whole adjustment. Do you yeah. play soccer there? Um, yes, I do. And I used to play for town. I don't know if I'm still going to do that. What position? Uh, midfield and sometimes strikers. So, I got it. did you watch the Copa America? No, no you didn't. Did you see the, did you, are you a soccer watcher at all or just player? Um, I watch it sometimes, but... Mostly. Did you see the goal Lionel Messi scored where he just right in the top corner I against the U.S.? Did, yeah, it was something. So, Jesse, artist, you said you like colored pencils. What about that? Why, why colored pencils? Why not markers? Why not paint? Why not um, crayons? I do a lot of different mediums. Um, I like to experiment a lot, but colored pencils, I just feel like I have a lot of, I have a good grasp on them and I can produce work that. I always had trouble, like when you hold it at the angle and then you shade and then it, the pencil would always just break. How do you, how do you get the shading down? That was always the hardest part to me. Um, I got, I just practice, I guess. Just to give, practice, yeah. practice, practice. Yeah. What's your, what, what do you like to draw? Uh, I do a lot of things. A lot of things. What's yeah. your, uh, do you like to draw like landscapes, action shots, self portraits, other people's portraits? I don't know, I just do a, little, a bit of everything, I think. I try to mix it up a lot. What's your favorite piece that you've ever done? What are you, what are you the most proud of? Um, well, I submitted a piece into a national competition and I got an honorable mention. It was wow, a very charcoal cool. portrait of my dad. So Wow, I bet he too. loved that. Was that like a Father's Day gift? Yeah, it was really good? Yeah, it was It was his birthday gift, I think. Oh, that's, all, that's awesome, yeah. man. That's awesome. Do you, do you ever draw your sister playing soccer? <laughs> Uh, no, I haven't done that yet. I should probably try that. I think that'd be cool. That'd be a cool yeah. little, little gift for your parents. What, um, how long would it take you to draw me right now? Um, probably a few, mm, yeah, probably a few hours. Yeah, you gotta, gotta get out all the ugly, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you guys, so, so that, that's two kind of dynamics. Do you, do you ever find those worlds, those paths crossing? I know, like, I asked you, do you ever draw her? But do, does that ever, art and sports, does that ever overlap for you guys? Well, I mean, we both like to, I mean, the only thing that kind of crosses is that, like, I like to do art too, and he kind of does sports, so it's Yeah. All right, well, you're a swimmer, right? Yeah. How do, you feel, how do you feel about Michael Phelps in the upcoming Olympics? You ready? Yeah. yeah he's got it? Yeah. You a big Phelps guy? Yeah, I, yeah, I'd say so. What, what about, is it just because he wins all the time? or? I don't know, just something about who is, it. Who is the other one, the one who everybody, uh, the other American who was in the watch commercial? Everybody thought he was a little not totally there. Um, not, the other sure. American swimmer, do you know who I'm talking about? No, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I can't remember. If I saw it, I might be able to identify Yeah, anyway. So you're going to watch the Olympics? Yes. Yeah. Definitely. What do you what do you think about the athletes not going down? Both of you, what do you guys think about some of the athletes kind of being hesitant because of the uh, the virus that's down there? Um, I, don't know. I don't know if you guys know anything about that. Yeah, Zika. Um, I don't know. Be cautious, I guess. I don't know if that's a word. Do you think that's right? Do you think it's worth? I mean, a lot of athletes. This is their peak, especially the swimmers. Yeah. This is the mm -hmm. peak of their careers. Do you think it's worth sacrificing for that? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. It's kind of sad that it has to. This virus has to come when people are trying to kind of. Their best. Live their dreams, right? Yeah, absolutely. Well, uh, Jules, Jesse, you guys are great up here. Thanks for joining me. Would you do this again? Yeah. So one last question. Uh, if you had your own show, we'll do this individually. So uh, we'll go Jesse first. I started with Jules. If you had your own show, 15 minutes, talk about whatever you want, whatever guests you want to have on, whatever topics, what would it be about? Um, I don't know. <sighs> that, wait, forget a show. If you could just talk for 15 minutes nonstop about anything, what would you talk about? I don't know. Maybe like small talk about people's chat. lives. Just have your friend. Just yeah. have a show. Where you have your friends on. Just chat, talk, yeah. catch up. That'd be a good show. I'd watch that. What about so you? A guest. You can you can have guests. You don't have to have guests. Whatever well, you I, whatever you want. Fifteen minutes. Do whatever you want. Or just try and engage in a conversation about whatever they want to talk about. Just ask them first. So you cater to the guests. Yeah, so that it's not just like forcing a topic. So you, upon are you like an Ellen fan, an Oprah fan, Steve Harvey? Yeah. You like those kind of shows? All right. I, that, is that kind of what you're looking at? Hey, that would be a lot of fun. Look, Ellen's like the most popular person on the yeah. planet. She. Finding Dory, I'm very excited yeah. for. I don't know how you guys feel. You, how was it? How was it? Don't spoil it. It was good. It was good. Okay, good. I'm excited. I can't wait to see it. I need some time to go see it. Anyways, Jules, Jesse, thanks for joining me for Metro Fest. I'm Alex Barth. Thanks for watching.